Welcome. We are members of Medicinal Chemistry Research Lab. Topic of discussion. Distillation. Definition. Types. Principle. Uses. Azeotropic distillation. Definition. Principle. What are azeotropes? Simple distillation versus azeotropic distillation. Extractive distillation versus azeotropic distillation. Procedure will be discussed of. Distillation and azeotropic distillation. Distillation. Definition. A process involving the separation of different components by converting a liquid into vapor and then vapor is condensed back to liquid form. Principle. The components in mixture having enough difference in their boiling points are heated together. These are miscible liquids and they form vapor on heating and these vapors are converted back to liquid form by cooling. The volatile liquid evaporates first and then can be recovered by cooling in liquid form. Types of distillation. There are many types of distillation but the most common types of distillation are following. Steam distillation. Vacuum distillation. Fractional distillation. Azeotropic distillation. 1. Steam distillation. It is a type of distillation in which liquid is separated by passing steam. It is used for those liquids which are not very volatile and immiscible with water. Example. Distillation of orange oil. 2. Vacuum distillation. In this type of distillation liquid is distilled by reducing pressure which enables the liquid to boil at low temperature. Example. Distillation of ocean water. 3. Fractional distillation. In fractional distillation liquids having different boiling points are separated from reaction mixture into fractions by using fractionating column. Example. Separation of acetone and water. What if two components in a mixture have same boiling points? We will use azeotropic distillation. Uses. Distillation is used for many commercial processes. For the production of gasoline, distilled water, xylene, alcohol, paraffin, kerosene, and many other liquids. Gas may be liquefied and separate. For example, nitrogen, oxygen, and argon are distilled from air. Azeotropic distillation. Definition. It is a type of distillation in which liquids are separated from mixture by adding some entrains or components to improve separation. Mostly benzene or water are used as entrains. Principle. Azeotropic distillation is a process technique to break an azeotrope in distillation. In general azeotropic distillation is a specific technique in which other component is added to generate a new lower boiling azeotrope that is heterogeneous producing two immiscible liquid phases, for example, addition of benzene to water and ethanol. What is a zeotrope or a zeotropic mixture? An azeotrope or azeotropic mixture is a mixture of substance which has same concentration of vapor and fluid phases that cannot be separated by simple distillation. It is usually the mixture of two or more liquids. A zeotropic mixture have the constant, same boiling point and the mixture. Vapor will also have the same proportion of liquid. Hence a zeotropic distillation is a limited distillation in scattering the azeotropes. What is the difference between simple distillation and azeotropic distillation? The key difference between simple distillation and azeotropic distillation is in the process of separating the mixture. By combining the separating solvent azeotropic distillation forms an azeotrope. This azeotrope can be a complicated way of separating the mixture because it cannot be easily changed by just a simple distillation. In simple distillation the boiling points of separating solvents are different but in azeotropic distillation there is no or very small difference in the boiling points of solvents. What is difference between extractive distillation and azeotropic distillation? The main difference between extractive and azeotropic distillation is that in azeotropic distillation, the formation of an azeotrope occurs which facilitate the separation of components of a mixture whereas, in extractive distillation, no azeotrope formation takes place. In both these distillation techniques, a non-volatile component is added to the mixture that can affect the volatility of components in the mixture. Now we will discuss the procedure of distillation. We will use heating mental for distillation. This apparatus contains a heating mental including some beads which heats and convert liquid into vapors which go upward. Now we will put impure and hexane as sample in the heating mental. We will turn on the heating mental and wait till the boiling point of N hexane is obtained. After some time the liquid will start boiling. 
Now we will observe rising vapors from heating mental. These vapors will collide with each other while moving upward. This will cause to loose them their kinetic energy. We can notice the conversion of these vapors after collision into liquid. This liquid is going into the collecting bottle where distilled N-hexane has been collected. This N-hexane is now pure. This process will be continued until all the N-hexane is distilled and collected in the bottle. Now we will discuss the procedure of azeotropic distillation. The ethanol and water mixture will be taken. An entrainer like benzene will be added to it in the flask. Now the entrainer will produce an azeotrope and this azeotrope will become vapor and form two layers known as organic layers and aqueous layers. The organic layer contain entrainer. Now some of the entrainer may return back to column 1. The aqueous and entrainer mixture will move towards column 2. Due to steam the water will be separated below the column and entrainer will return back to the column 1. That's how we can separate an azeotropic mixture. Thanks for watching. Comment if you have any questions.